is the true measure of a monster. If you are not scary, what kind of a monster are you? It's my job to make great students greater, not make mediocre students less mediocre. That is why at the end of the semester there will be a final exam. Fail that exam and you are out of the scaring program. So, I should hope you're all properly inspired. Dame Helen Mirren, it's such an honour to be in your company today and congratulations on a fantastic movie. Thank you. It's always so exciting to see what you're going to do next because no two roles are the same <laughs> and you, true. you keep everything so varied. So what was the, um, what was the appeal here with uh, Dean Hardscrabble? Well, it, it, it wasn't so much Dean Hardscrabble as a Pixar movie, mm -hmm. you know. I've been a huge fan of Pixar movies um, ever since Pixar first sort of came on, on, on the, into, our, uh, into our world. Um, I thought it, it was just such a revelation and so utterly de delightful. Yeah. The spirit, the soul behind them, those mm -hmm. movies is just so kind and sweet and funny. It's good for funny, adults as well. As good kids. for adults, yeah. good for kids. They're complete classics. Mm -hmm. And I've seen generation after generation of kids fall in love with toy stories and become obsessed with Buzz Goodyear <laughs> and, you know, yeah. uh, Buzz, uh, Buzz Lightyear. Lightyear yeah. um, and um, to infinity and beyond. <laughs> I mean, just, you know, I'd watch that movie over and over again. And I did, and I'm so stupid. To infinity and beyond, it's, it's I so suddenly <laughs> realised what that meant. Yeah. You know, infinity is infinity. In other words, there is no beyond. Yeah. You know, and that sort of idea of to infinity and beyond. And more, yeah. Uh, and I, that only da dawned on me comparatively recently. <laughs> I'm that stupid. Um, <laughs> but um, so anyway, you know mm -hmm. what? Utter, utter delight. So when John Lasseter, who actually has become a friend of my husband and mine in in, um, in Los Angeles mm -hmm. said, I've got a role for you. <laughs> I said, oh, thank God at last. I'm it's a great role. be in the library of Pixar movies. Yeah, she's a very familiar yeah. character to me now from my days in school. I'm just wondering, does she remind you of any characters you've met in your life? I didn't go to that sort of university, you know. I actually <laughs> trained as a teacher, funnily enough. But really? So um, you had a bit of background experience A then. little bit, <laughs> you know, a little bit. But, but I can imagine the dean of that very high-powered mm. Harvard-type university, which is Terrifying. <laughs> so hard to get into. So all the kids from yeah. all over America of, are, are, the, are the triple A mm -hmm. students, you know, A++++. Plus 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 plus. They, they are the creme de la creme, as they say. And now they're all in university together. And there is the dean of that university. And, and that's the sort of environment we're mm -hmm. talking of here. You get to um, work again There's a similarity, here. in a sense, to the um, Maggie Smith character in Harry Potter. Yeah, yeah, it's, it is it. quite similar. It would have been a Isn't good one it? for you, yes. too. Yeah. So you get to reunite here with Billy Crystal, who you worked with on the hilarious Funnier oh, yes, Dying yes, video. Oh, yes, yes, Grandpires, yes. Because When Harry Met Sally is my favourite movie of all time. So to see that come, it was just hilarious. How fun was that to make? Oh, that was fun to make. It was. It was great. And, yeah. and to work with, you know, a master. Masterful yeah. um, comedian like like Billy Crystal. Of course, he's he's such a sweetheart. He's got you know a wonderful family, and it was just it was a family affair the whole thing. And with all yeah. the Shakespearean experience in theatre, is it still hard to keep a straight face when you go to do something like that? You don't need to keep a straight face when you do <laughs> something like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, no, it was it was just absolutely mm. great on a hot couple of days in, yeah. in Los Angeles. Yes. Now, I was such a fan of The Queen, your Oscar-winning performance, so I can't not ask about that. And I know you're starring as The Queen again in the audience at the moment, but it was just it was such an amazing performance. I'm just wondering, was it that a nervous role to take on? Or was, yes. the, was it quite enticing? That was scary. Was it? That was scary. Because of her reaction, maybe? Or? No, no, not because of her reaction. Yeah. No, I knew that there would never be any reaction there. Really? I certainly didn't want to... Um, I knew I didn't say yes to the role until I'd read the script because mm -hmm. I didn't I cert I wouldn't have been in something that I felt was unfair or you know mean spirited. Mm -hmm. So the script came in and I thought it was rather beautiful. Um, so, but having said that, anything to do with the royal family in Britain, and let alone the rest of the world, but in particular in Britain, it just gains. A, we have such a weird love. Not hate, but you know, 
we're so yeah. messed up about so our involved. attitude to the royal yeah. family. We can't, uh, you know, the, the public can't get their heads around it. Mm -hmm. and, and so anything to do with the royal family gains a huge amount of attention. Definitely. And it was that attention that I was frightened mm -hmm. of, of putting a foot wrong, of finding myself, you know, either letting, letting the side down somewhere or other. Mm -hmm. Um, so I knew I had to navigate that quite yeah. carefully. Amazing. And I have to say, my heart just melted when I read the story about you going to visit that sick boy. It was just, it was amazing. I didn't go to visit him. He came to oh, visit me. Oh, yes, he me. came to visit you. Yes, so he we came named to the you, dressing. We named you our ledge bag of the week uh, that we got for oh, entertainment. It was it, an amazing I story. I have to say, I, do, I really can't take credit for that. It was organised by the um, charity, okay. um, who, who are a, a, a charity in the north who who fulfill wishes of, of basically children who are mm -hmm. dying Amazing. and his wish was that and obviously the Queen couldn't do it so um, I stepped in and, and the, the other people in the theatre helped so it was it, it was a, a group effort. Dame Hilmarine thank you so much. Thank for you. Welcome to the scare floor. Yeah. How do I become a scare? I'm officially a college student! Mike Wazowski. James B. Sullivan. Like Bill Sullivan? He's my dad. I expect big things from you. I just need to ace my classes, graduate with honors, and become the greatest scarer ever. Were you kissing my hand? And what about you with all your shedding? I don't shed. Really? The star player has just arrived. You're my hero! Yeah! Slow down, squirt! This is a party for scare students. I am a scare student. I mean for scare students who actually, you know, have a chance. Just wait, Hotshot. I'm gonna scare circles around you this year. <laughs> <laughs> Behold, my brothers of Uzma Kappa! I'm Art! Tell you, man, let's keep a dream journal! I'm a dance major! And I'm not. They're not exactly the scariest group in the world. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I could show everybody that Mike Wazowski is something special. Just reach deep down and let the scary out. Boys! Oh, scary. Up top. <laughs> the whole school is finally going to see what Mike Wazowski can do. Time to go to work. Scary feet, scary feet, scary feet. The kids in the bathroom. <laughs> Poodle, Jazz Clown, my Aunt Phyllis, in the morning. Quiet. What's so scary about a little old librarian? I said. Move it, move it. Ah! Hey, I want a piece of that action. Tentacles and serpents' wings, they do. Can't wait to start scaring with you, brothers. We're going to rip you to pieces. Don't go in there. Have fun, kids! I'll just be here listening to my tunes. <laughs>